we go. So what I'm going to do is it's a VR experience. It's an illusion of a VR experience. So you're not going to interact with the 3D space. What you are going to do though is you're going to feel that depth of field. You're going to be able to look around the car. I'll disappear while it's happening. And then obviously um, at about a minute in, it then starts to highlight certain features where you'll have the features, the screens floating in the middle of nowhere. So I'm just going to set it up for you and then press play and hand over. All right, let's just take this back to the start. Hello future Nava, this is your i3 speaking to you. Don't be startled. I, will reset I am delighted to have you on board as we accelerate the next phase of the NAV journey from FNB. The bank is revving up. I am delighted to have you on board as we accelerate the next phase of the NAV journey from FNB. The bank is revving up their commitment to helpful solutions this time with a focus on a set of efficient wheels like me. Think of Navcar as a Lone Ranger on a crusade to champion the... Mm. Of course, play. The car shut down. <laughs> oh. No, it will come back now. So just keep looking around by the time... Uh... I mean, you've got more experience with this than of most, so I must it. say, oh, it's an extremely okay. clever cool. plan, even if I say so myself. As soon as you're comfortable, look at the bottom left corner of my windscreen. Hmm, that's what I'm talking about. You can scan my license disc on the front of my scan bar. I call it my identity monitor, but you can call it the FNB app. You will now be getting a reminder to renew my license at the end of June. How cool is that? It's one of NAVCAR's top features. You get proactive notifications, easy vehicle license renewal from the comfort of your seat, and a payment to your door. It's just like my super pursuit mode. No more frustrating time-consuming processes or late payment penalties, just full speed ahead. Now check out my center console, but be gentle. Ah, and thank goodness for my regenerative braking system. We never have to worry at roadblocks because Navcar has another super sleek shortcut that allows you to stay on top of my speeding fines. It helps with instant notifications and in-app payment. And when we have a top speed of 150 kilometers per hour, it's a useful tool to have. Now, look up at my review mirror. Are you ready for surveillance mode? Prime specimens like me like to stay tuned to their specs. Navcar's quick and easy garage management allows you to manage both myself and my other siblings in one useful digital garage just by scanning a license disc. Although, I'm financed through West Bank, so all my vehicle details are loaded automatically onto Navcar. That means you get easy access to my important personal information like NATO's documents if you ever plan on changing our relationship status. Speed up and have a look at your gate. I know, it's quite a comprehensive range of tools. Just don't ask me for a cup of coffee. I'm not programmed to brew, but I am rather sensitive and I have an internal tracker that monitors my current well, this gets displayed awesome. to you instantly it is. and I'm, for I'm free. Annoyed with the signal it's hard break. Connecting through YouTube. Really? But when you're ready That's, to um, put yeah. me out That's to pop... technology, I guess. Oh, it's, <laughs> it's a very nice app that or video that they did. Yeah, it's like a... Yeah, it's flipping cool. But can you imagine how cool it would be if you had an Oculus Rift on? Uh, you know, you, you, that would be ideal. But, but what, what's nice is you're actually sitting in the car. Yes. And that makes a difference. That's the experience so you want to create. Right? Yeah. Kind of, I disappear, you get to look around, you intact, etc. What's, what's killer 